Hi students, it's Miss Beckman. Welcome back to music. Get ready for a fun kindergarten lesson. Let's start out with warming up our voices. Woo! Your turn. Woo, 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 woo. Good. Let's try this one. Wee, 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 wee. Now try. Now try like riding a roller coaster. Get ready. Buckle yourself in. That was fun. Now let's try um, uh, Papa Bear. Ready? My turn. Papa Bear. Baby Bear. Mama Bear. Let's use our Mama Bear voice to sing. Tommy Thumb, Tommy Thumb, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Peter Pointer, Peter Pointer, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Finger tall, finger tall, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Ruby ring, ruby ring, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Baby small, baby small, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Fingers all, fingers all, where are you? Here we are, here we are, how do you do? Wave all your fingers now. Great job. Now let's try, um, Remembering our instrument families. We learned all about the families of the orchestra. And today we're going to play a game to set a princess free and see if she can turn a frog into a prince. And it's a fun game that I'm about to show you. This um, website will be your assignment today for the, this week. I'll put the link in the assignment. And when you go to this website, take a picture or a video of you performing the assignment and then attach it to the Google document. So it says, what instrument do you hear? The princess is dreaming of the frog becoming her prince. Can you help? On each page, you will see three instruments. When an instrument plays, choose the one you hear. If you are right, you will hear this song. I'm clicking the crown. Okay, so if you get it right, you'll hear that and the frog will turn into the prince. But if you are wrong, you will hear this sound. Which means that the frog is still a frog. So let's play. I'll, I'll play two rounds with you so that you can see what, how it goes. So for the first one, I'm going to click the frog to hear the instrument. Then I need to click which instrument I think that one was. Now, it sounded like somebody was hitting it, maybe with a hammer. Hmm. And it had different notes. I'm going to go ahead and pick this one. That means I got it right. Okay, I'm going to go to the next one by clicking this red arrow. All right, let's hear the sound by clicking the frog. That was a fun song. Um, so I'm listening to that sound, and to me, it sounds like someone is having to blow into the instrument. So it's probably not this string instrument. 
It could be this one or this one. I'm going to try to answer this one. Uh-oh. I guess it's not that one. Hmm. Now that I think about it, it didn't really sound like a metal sound. It sounded more like wood. So that means that I probably it was this one, the woodwind. Wait a second. That's the instrument Ms. Beckman played for you. You remember in class I played it for you? The clarinet? Let's see if that's the right answer. It is. Wonderful. So I want you to play this game out home uh, for about three or five minutes and see how many answers you can get correctly. Take a short 30 second uh, video, 15 seconds of you uh, um, picking the correct answer on one of the questions and you'll get 100 on your assignment, making sure to put the picture or the video up into the Google Drive. Thank you. Okay, so now um, let's take a quick break from that. And I want you guys to copy Miss Beckman making a pattern. Let's try this one. Your turn. My turn. That's four snaps. Now, if you can't snap, it's okay. Just pretend. My turn again. Let's see now. Now listen again. Good. Now we're going to mix it up. My turn first. Ready? Go. My turn. Listen. Let's try something with our feet. Okay, this is going to be fun. Okay, so make sure you stomp your feet. Stomp your feet. All right. Your turn. Go. Good. Let's do some feet and legs. My turn first. Your turn, go. Awesome job. You're making rhythm with your body. Now, I want to show you something that we did last time with animal sounds. So here is our um, animal sounds that we did last time, but I added a few more for you. Let's go ahead and just start by making all the sounds of these animals. Look at this one. What sound does that animal make? Bzzz. You're right. Okay, what about this one? Make that sound. Meow. Good. What about this one? Moo. Awesome. And this one? Ba. Okay, make this sound. Nay. Okay, now let's make all of those sounds had a long sound. Now let's make some short sounds. Let's do this. Your turn. Okay. Oink, oink, oink. Good. What about this one? Squeak, squeak, squeak. This one? Woof, woof. How about this one? Tweet, tweet, tweet. And this one? Blub. Blip, blip. Okay, well, let's make some patterns using our four heartbeats. First, I want you to take your finger and point to each heartbeat. Ready, set, go. One, two, three, four. Okay, well, let's go ahead and put some animals into the hearts. We'll put a cat, sheep. We'll also put two baby mice, one. Two. And then the last one is going to be a bumblebee. Okay, so let's make the sounds. And notice I put two mouse, so you're two mice. So you're going to go squeak, squeak. Okay, so so far we have meow, ba, squeak, squeak, bzz. Your turn, say it. Meow, ba, squeak, squeak, bzz. Very good. Okay, let's go ahead and switch out some animals. Let's go ahead and instead of the cat, let's put two piggies. One, make it a little smaller. Two. And then instead of the bee, let's put the cow. 
So now we're going to have a new pattern. Oink, oink, ba, squeak, squeak, moo, your turn, go. Oink, oink, ba, squeak, squeak, moo. Well, that was really fun. Okay, let's do one more. Goodbye, sheepy. Let's put in two baby birdies. Notice when I'm putting in a short sound, I'm doing two of them. And when there's a long sound, I'm just doing one. Goodbye, Mr. Cow. Let's put in, hmm, do a horsey. Okay, so this one's gonna sound like, hmm, I'm gonna give you a minute to practice yours. How is it gonna sound? Read it like a word and make the sounds. Okay, let's do it together. Take your finger and point. Ready, set, go. Oink, oink, squeak. Oh, that's my fault. I messed up. Try again, go. Oink, oink, tweet, tweet, squeak, squeak, nay. Do it one more time. Oink, oink, tweet, tweet, squeak, squeak, nay. That was fun. Oh my goodness. Great job. Now, I want you guys to watch because if you remember Mr. Tukey, well, he's still at school, but he sent me a drawing and, and he wanted me to share with you some artwork. Y'all remember Mr. Tukey? He's a little puppet. Zoo, zoo, zoo. He likes to fly everywhere. And he actually made some drawings and wanted to share them with you. So I'm gonna show you some of Mr. Tukey's drawings. Okay, here we go. So this is Mr. Tukey's first drawing. I want you to take your finger and trace it in the air, and we're going to use our voices. So we're going to go like this. You try that with your voice and with your finger going down. Ready? Go. Awesome. Well, he made another drawing. How are we going to do this one? You try it. That's kind of fun. It's like we're sliding all over the place. Take your finger up and let's trace it together. Ready? Go. That's fun. Let's do two more. This one's crazy. We get to be all wiggly wiggly. Start up here. Let's try that again. Ready? Go. All right, one more for today. That's Mr. Tukey's last drawing for today. All right, so we start down here. Ready, set. Okay, we're going to start in Papa Bear or Baby Bear voice. Which one? Papa Bear voice. Very good. Okay, here we go. Ready, go. Ooh. Don't forget to go all the way up to Baby Bear voice and then down to Papa Bear voice. All done. Great job. Okay, now we are going to learn a new song. This is Mr. Tukey's favorite song, and he wants you to learn it. So I'm going to sing, like, this hand is Mr. Tukey, and this hand is Miss Beckman. Kind of like when we were talking with our fingers earlier. Now we're going to pretend like this hand is Mr. Tukey, and this hand is Miss Beckman. All right, here we go. Listen to my song. Two, two. Who are you? I'm a bird. Sing then. Tweet, 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 tweet. So Mr. Kooky was, Mr. Tukey was saying a funny sound. He was saying what? Coo, coo. That's funny. So he was singing that part. Let's learn the song. Copy Ms. Beckman. My turn first. Coo, coo. My turn. Who are you? I'm a bird. Sing then. Tweet, 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 tweet. Good. So let's go ahead and uh, do two pieces now. I'll be Mr. Tukey and Ms. Beckman, then you copy after two parts. My turn. Coo, coo, who are you? My turn. I'm a bird. Sing then. My turn. Tweet, 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 tweet. 
Good. Let's try the whole thing. So we'll do the whole song and get your fingers up and pretend to talk to each other like Mr. Tukey and Miss Beckman. Ready and go. Cuckoo, who are you? I'm a bird. Sing them. Tweet, 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 tweet. Let's try now to um, make our voices different. Let's try to make Mr. Tukey's voice kind of like Baby Bear. We're going to go. Cuckoo. Try that. Ready? Go. Cuckoo. All right, and then for Miss Beckman's voice, let's make it very big and open like this. Who are you? Like that. So we're gonna go, Kim, Kim, who are you? You're gonna act it out with your face and your voice. Let's try the whole song again. We'll start with Kim, Kim, ready, go. Kim, Kim, who are you? I'm a bird, sing them. Three, 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 three. Oh, that was awesome. Oh man. We're gonna do more with that song because that's a really fun song that we can do lots of fun games with, okay? But for now, I just want you to practice that one. And don't forget, for your homework, you are going to practice on the website that says, which musical instrument do you hear? And you get to pick one and hopefully turn the frog into a prince. All right, students, I'll see you later. Bye now, I'll see you next time. Have a great week of music.